My name is David Ragg. I'm a third generation florist from the UK. But I'm going to be using again some materials that maybe you might discard or not even think about using with your floral ingredients. The first thing I'm going to do is just get some of this wool fibre, pull it out a little bit. Don't want a big clump of it. I'm just going to place this ball, the off cut of the ball, onto the dish. Add a little bit of water in the top. We can add more later. This amount of Oasis foam will hold quite a lot of water. So that will do to start off with. Just gives it a little bit of weight so it sits nice and steady. And I'm going to work with all the glossy side, so all the painted side of the tiles towards me. Don't worry too much about the spacing. We may be removing some of these later when we add the flower in. The flowers I've chosen to use with this design are all in a lovely sort of fresh colour palette. And then also we have this beautiful little mini Phalaenopsis plant, taking the carnations off nice and short. And then these are going to be tucked in between. So I have quite a good distribution of the flower material with the carnations in the hydrangea now. Now to add in the orchid, let's say a beautiful, delicate flower. I love the way they're just sort of like hovering over the rest of the design here. Placing it into the oasis and then just a little bend of the stem. Just some little tufts of the wool fibre and we're just going to be tucking this in. I'm just using the back of the knife here. Take a bit of time to go over the entire design. It just gives it this lovely, soft, feathery sort of feeling amongst all those hard edges. So there you have it. This is my low-level coffee table design, maybe, featuring broken tiles and wool fiber as the uh, non-botanical elements. Beautiful mint green carnations and hydrangea, and then these wonderful little mini Phalaenopsis orchids, which just create a wonderful sort of statement piece.